Hello everyone, uh, this is a second lesson in the mathematics series. Uh, today we're going to be working on ratios and the question is there are a couple of sweets in the bag, 18 are toffees and 12 are mints and it's simply stating you to write the ratio of what they've given. So we're going to simply write 18 to 12 but they've asked to simplify oops sorry okay they want us to simplify um, we look for the largest number that can be divided into these so um, about nine would go into there but not there seven okay six goes three times and uh, two times that's simplified and it can't be any more simplified than this so that's the answer to the first part of the question and that is two marks. That's very easy. Okay, the next part of the question gives us the total number of... Okay, one second. Okay, um, the second question says the total number of oranges and apples is 54. Total equals 54. And um, they, are, they, they say the ratio of the number of oranges to apples, oranges to apples is 1 to 5. So we write that down. So that's a ratio, 1 to 5. And it says work out the number of apples in the box. So we know the total number is 54. So we're going to use a box method. We're going to write 54 at the top. Okay. And then um, we're going to write the ratio near the bottom. 1, 2, 5. What we're going to do here is we're going to add the two numbers together. So outside the box we're going to write 6 and divide it by the original the total number so 54 divided by 6 equals 9 so that's our multiplier so we got times by 9 and times by 9 there and so that's 9 there and 45 and that's basically our box and so the question was work out the number of apples in the box and our apples is the five side that means there are 45 apples in the box and that is pretty much what ratio is it will come in different forms but you can use this box method almost for all of them my mistake there you can use the box method from almost all of the ratio questions and the simplifying ones are particularly easy anyway and so if you have any problems with any questions, feel free to inbox me and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you very much.